I recently performed at a comedy club that had LED lights for the stage spotlights and a friend of mine filmed my performance. The problem is that the LED lights seem to run directly on AC and so they flicker at the line rate of about 60 hertz and the film was shot at roughly 30 frames per second so every now and then the camera would pick up a dark period when the LEDs were dim and this is very distracting. Here's a, an example of the flickery video. And I'm going to show you how to remove the flicker so that you end up with something like this instead. I'm going to show you a simple trick for getting rid of this flicker. Now the video editor I use is called Kden Live, which is a free open source video editor for Linux. But you can use this in any video editor that supports opacity, which should be pretty much any video editor. Okay, so the first thing you do is start up a project. You put your clip in the project bin and then you drag the clip onto the timeline like that. So there we have our clip on the timeline. Everything's good. And then you grab another copy of the clip and put it on the timeline like this. So you have two identical copies of the video. You take the top one and you ungroup it from the sound. So I'll say ungroup clips. And then I'm going to delete this sound clip because we only really need one soundtrack. We don't need two. Now here's where the magic comes in. We go all the way to the beginning of the clip. Zoom way in on the timeline, way, way in as far as we can zoom. And then we just grab this top clip and we move it one frame to the right. So it's offset by one frame from the other track. Okay. So if I toggle the visibility of the top one, you'll see that it's one frame off from the other one. We then add an, an effect to this track, to the top one, and we set the opacity at 50%. So now what you're seeing is a mixture of the two tracks essentially. So if we, if we go to some random point in the video, like here for example, what you're seeing is the average of the two tracks. So that's the bottom track. That's just the top track. It's a little dimmer because it's only 50% opaque. Um, but together you're seeing the average. And this will average out those flickers com almost completely. It does blur the motion a little bit because you're basically averaging two frames. But in my tests, that hasn't been a problem. So here for your final viewing is the before and after video side by side so you can really compare the effects. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Please like, please subscribe, and I'll talk to you next time.